What's going on everybody? So today I am on NHL 18. Competitive season just ended at 4 30 p.m. I believe today my time I don't know wherever you guys are it's different for you and uh, as you can see I'm at the main menu right now because they have also released new evolution players of course I have enough evolution collectibles and a carbon to be able to do this set so I'm really excited to see what they are I don't know who it is yet I have speculations of who Wow, that was so close that I almost knocked over all my water. Holy moly, let me move that. Who's gonna get one? I'm gonna say maybe Duncan Keith, Phil Kessel. Uh, Tyler Sagan doesn't have one yet. I don't know if he'll get one. But I'm gonna say maybe like Roman Yossi, Duncan Keith, Phil Kessel are the top ones. Players that either don't have cards yet. I don't know who else doesn't really have a card. Braden Shen might have one. I don't know what it is, but I have enough for one of them, so I'm going to open up that in the video. I haven't opened up one all year because the sets have been really expensive and not really worth it, but I was able to gather up a bunch of evolution collectibles, and it was actually worth it for me to do it this time, so I'm really excited. I don't know who it's going to be, but let's see here. It should be right there. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. That's not bad. Claude Giroux, Roman Yossi, and McDonough. Realistically, I'm going to get Ryan McDonough, which sucks, but did anybody else get upgrades? Brad Marchand's evolution card got an upgrade. That's cool. I was going to buy it, and I didn't, which sucks. Anybody else? Uh, Team of the Week, Ice, Christmas Burns. The lights still haven't... Have they even updated? I guess they've updated in... Um, it wasn't 46 million, but we're still at round five, which sucks. Let me just go and do the set here. Pray to God I get Roman Yossi or Giroux. I said in a video last week that I did actually open up one before. It was last week's one. I was saving it for this week and anticipating that there would be a lot of really cool cards out. Um, and I got really impatient and opened it anyways and got Giroux. Uh, did I get Drury? No, I got Barkov, I think. I don't remember if I got Drury or Barkov, but either way, they're not that great. And um, I'm kind of hoping that since I'm opening up this one on camera this week that I can get a little bit more lucky. We'll see. If I can get the Claude Giroux, that would be phenomenal. I don't know how many cards he's going to get. He might get some upgrades, but um, I don't know. Along with the Evolution Pack, I have my Competitive Seasons Packs, which is originally what this video was going to be, is just a Competitive Seasons Pack opening. But uh, I only got five packs, and I don't really think that's... I don't really want to open up five packs on a video, especially 25k packs, which the chances of me getting something good are not too great. I decided to get a Team of the Week pack here, trade in some Christmas Snowflake collectibles to a rare player. I have yet to get a really good player out of this one. I got... Uh, some good players out of the transfer them to 10, but I do also have a 50k pack, another 25k pack, a 75k pack, which I got, and this, which I got off the market, and then all of the rest of these are gifted except the evolution player. And I'm going to start it off with the team of the week pack. Now, the team of the week's okay. It's not great. There's a lot of high rated players, but they're not going to go for anything, so I don't really care what I get, but okay, Jake Allen. Mm, not great. I'm going to keep him because. Uh, Goalies in this game have a shelf life, and if I ever need to substitute him in for a few games, maybe I'll try him out. Who knows? Let's go through these ones, though, and uh, see what we can get. Wow! That's not bad! I'll take the 87 Joe Pavelski. That's really good, actually. I haven't... He's probably the best player I've gotten out of all of them. I've opened up quite a few off-camera just because they're not that great. Nathan McKinnon? Okay, I already have his ice card transferred up, so that's uh, kind of useless. But I'll keep him anyways. It would have been cool to have gotten his ice, McKinnon. But, uh, because that's off again. Wow. 85. McKinnon's like a really good 85 overall player. And then along with that, we get Kuznetsov and Pavelski. These have been phenomenal on camera. Maybe I should just start opening them on camera more often. And then Jared Spurgeon. Okay. Well, that settles it. Let me open up the gold plus pack. Save all of the cool special packs for the end. And, uh, we just went through like probably six packs, I think. So, we're not too good there. Let me get a gold collectible, though. That would be awesome, and then I can maybe up, uh, upgrade somebody at the end of the video. Andrew Kopp, okay. Oh, Brent, oh, Jonathan Joy and Brent Burns. Back to, does Brent Burns have an upgraded ice card? Might have to try that out, even though I have his Christmas 90, which is kind of useless. Where's my other rare player? I'll keep those two. Oh, uh, yeah, it was Felino. Okay, well, that's not bad. That's a pretty awesome start. Brent Burns and Ice Joy. Ice Joy is probably not going to go for anything. But you never know. I'm really excited to open this up, so I want to do it now. We'll see what I can get. I'm going to be happy with anybody, but I I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, yes! Yes, yes, yes! Oh, that is so lucky. That is really lucky, considering what I got last week. His card looks disgusting. 92 face off. Every stat is good. Every stat is good. Well, body checking is kind of crappy, but like... 
awesome deking, amazing shot. He's fast. He's got 92 faceoffs, 91 stick checking. This card is a beast. I am very glad that I did that. So I don't know how much he's gonna be. Probably not that much. But I'm really glad that I did that set and got him because that is awesome. I'm actually going to open up the 50k pack here. Then open up all of the 25k packs. Finish it off with the 75k pack. In anticipation that we'll get something good. There's Jake. Oh, okay. I'll take that. I'll take the ace card. There's Jake Allen. We just got his team of the week one. There are silvers in this pack. So we're going to get silvers as well. But, uh, oh, there's another one. Jake, or uh, Jake, Jack Eichel's ice card. It doesn't go for a whole lot. Maybe under, just under 20k, but still, that's pretty awesome. Two ice, on oh, another one. Oh my god, three ice cards in this pack. That is awesome. I'm actually going to keep, I'm going to keep all of it. Just in case I ended up I end up doing uh, some of the sets later on or something, I don't know. We'll see. So far, this has gone really well. Brent Burns, we got the best evolution of the week, which is so good. Like, it's so amazing. He's a new card. Definitely. I don't remember him. Oh, Kari Lettinen, okay. Okay, Milestone Lettinen. TJ Brody and the last rare, Cam Fowler. Okay. Oh, and Lundquist. This is 25 key packs, so you get more than that. I forgot. But uh, I'll keep Lundquist. He might have an upgrade, actually, which would be cool. I don't want to keep him, and uh, I don't think they'll go for anything, so we'll just get rid of that. Four more 25k packs. We still haven't gotten a gold collectible, which kind of sucks. Uh, we also haven't gotten any Christmas collectibles, which also kind of sucks as well. Oh my god, no way! No way did I just get that! Oh my god! Even if I had gotten... The 86 Ryan McDonough. They decided to give me the Roman Yossi either way. It doesn't even matter because I just got both of the best evolutions of the week in packs. That is so crazy. Holy, there's a Christmas collectible and a FNAF. Oh my god, that's so nuts. He's a really good player in this game and he's expensive. I remember I had his primetime Roman Yossi and it was, like, it was a lot of money. It was like 30k and it actually sold for that too. I can't get over that. Two evolution players in one pack opening. Uh, one's guaranteed, which like, it's guaranteed, so like it's not that cool. But like still, that's nuts that I just got both of them. And another Brent Burns. What is going on? What is actually going on? Malcolm Subban's new, but he doesn't go for anything. I already know that. Sean Corrales actually also a new player, I think. But he also doesn't go for anything. But... Two regular base card Brent Burns. This is nuts. As a matter of fact, that Evolution Yoshi was in my free packs for Competitive Seasons. That is so crazy. I finally get something like amazing in my Competitive Seasons rewards. I don't often get good stuff, so when I do, it's it's a blessing for sure. And uh, this pack's gonna get. Oh my god! No way! 94 is I was literally about to say that this pack is not going to contain anything good and out comes 90 overall Ice for Forsberg. I've opened up probably 4 or 5 25k packs just in the span of a couple of minutes and gotten way better things than I've gotten all year opening up 25k packs. Every, every single competitor seasons up until now my 25k packs have been garbage and now they are just amazing. This is so awesome. Ekholm, Stahl, David Backus, okay, all right, and the last rare, uh, Kevin Hayes, all right, well, that was, uh, that was a bit of a letdown, but I don't really care, we've gotten, how many 90 pluses, uh, probably only two, but a bunch of 88 pluses, like, probably eight or seven, but here we go, this is the last pack of the video, it is going to be a 75k pack, actually, I might have time, I might have enough coins for a 100, oh my god, what, what is going on? Two Philip Forsbergs in this pack opening. Two! Two of them! 90 overall and then a 91 overall. His card looks nasty. Oh my god, his shooting and everything. Wow, he looks really good. And a right-handed shot. That's hard to come by in this game. Wow. I don't even care what's in the rest of this. Nashville jerseys jersey. Nashville jerseys jersey. What am I saying? What? Like, what? I don't even know. But uh, there's a line A, which I could put into the set, but I don't really care that much. Because uh, Philip Forsberg's faster, probably has the decent uh, or the same shot as him, and um, frankly, I don't really want to spend a gold collectible. <laughs> There's a Bukestad, Maroon, Patrick Marlowe is just Milestone, but I don't care. 91! 91 overall! Wow, that is nuts, and it did the glitch again. Cool. 
But apart from him, I don't really care for these guys. So see you later. If Lani goes for something, whatever. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button. Comment down below your thoughts and opinions on the video. I just want to say that uh, I'm in the middle of exams for school and it's kind of a crazy time right now. So I don't know how many videos I'm going to be able to get out. This one I hope I will be able to edit and have it out for you on Saturday night. But apart from that, I probably won't have a video till like next Friday. Sorry about that, but I am really busy and I want to just get through this. Once again, if you are new to the channel and you do like this content, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to the channel. But for now, I will see you guys in the next video.